Hello everyone, I'm Sam Hickel, CM Application Schemist, and today I'm going to be talking to you about marking your disks. So, to start, we prefer to mark the non Teflon parts, such as the frame or even the cap of the vessel. Just make sure you don't mark it or put a sticker over the vent hole where you know, it's obstructed. You also don't want to put the stickers in between the liner and the sleeve because it can get stuck or attract microwaves, and that's bad. So, what you want to do is use either of these types of stickers, right, and stick it on your frame and number it. That's pretty much it. Um, yeah, so that's it for the stickers. Next we have what we call a heat resistant paint marker or high temperature marking pin. And you can use these on the Teflon pieces. So, for example, we like to write on the bottom of the liner so we know what number it is. That's good. You can also write on caps or you can write on the sleeves. It will slowly wear off of the sleeves over time, so you may have to remark it a few times. That's fine. All right, that's it for markers. Last but not least, we sometimes like to use electrical engravers. All right, the big thing with these is you don't want to mark or engrave on the bottom because it will obstruct where we read temperature. That's bad. Anywhere on the side is fine, and a lot of people like to engrave on the top. Perfectly fine. That's it.